everybody. Welcome to Hell Hasbro Reviews. It's your boy Deluxe. How y'all doing? Alright, I'm with the Sharecast Uncut group back there. I don't know if you can see that. Maybe I got a new little backdoor drop or whatever. Hope y'all like this. I'm trying the new uh, hands thing. Anyways, um, thought I'd do a little um, small, short little thing for a uh, 30th anniversary of Transformers the movie. Came out um, on Tuesday. Uh, yeah, I got this from Amazon. Pre-ordered this about two months ago, so I knew I was wanting to get it. I think I, I have the 20th anniversary, but it was uh, just DVD. Never owned the Blu-ray, so I thought, you know, I had to have this. So yeah, uh, this is, there's the front. Uh, it's pretty cool. You got the back. Just going to talk about some of the movies and the effect it had on me. You know, it may not be uh, what it had on you, but you know. This what it, so this this right here, right there. And you got the widescreen, and you got the full screen or full frame, right there. And it's got some um, special features, the bonus features. Um, Tolaro One is pretty cool. I just got done watching it. Um, it has a uh, Flint Dilly. Um, uh, what was the voice? Uh, it's got Sue Blue. It's got some other character, you know, uh, Greg Berger. Uh, Stan Bush on them, uh, the voice of uh, Springer, Neil Ross, I think. Um, had all them, you know, talking about the, you know, what they did, you know, and all that stuff and everything. It's pretty cool. I like that part. Um, the anim audio commentary, I didn't watch that. Featurettes, I think, is, is just a redo of the 20th anniversary because they were talking about, you know, 20 years ago and everything. And uh, the th trailer <laughs> and the TV spots were pretty cool. I mean, it was, you know, coming Sunday, Sunday, you know, or something like that and blah, blah. It was pretty fun. I mean, I watched it, you know, coming, you know, it's coming out, you know, the next day in August and everything. This one I watched. I went to the movies and watched it. Um, I got to see it one time. Uh, I think it was yeah, back in August. I was 10 years old and um, loved Transformers as a kid. And um, I got to actually go to the theater and watch it one time. So, so yeah, this is a, uh, it's all right. So I'm just going to talk about what the, you know, everybody knows what the movie is and what it means to them. Um, this was out in 86. Um, and back then, you know, they just wanted to sell toys. Basically, it was a long, you know, 30-minute toy commercial. And so, you know, a lot of, uh, so the movie came out in August, I think. Yeah, I think they said August, something like that. I remember going to the theater and watching it. And um, everybody knows um, Prime dies. Um, I cried, actually, and I'm uh, not too ashamed to say it. Um, and it was very traumatic, you know event you know kind of you know it was you know i watched these you know for a couple years and, you know after school and everything i had the toys you know and everything. It's just and to watch you know this such iconic role you know which not back then it wasn't iconic because they didn't know during the um commentary they said you know they didn't know that's the reason why they killed them off it was just basically a, a toy commercial so um they didn't know the killing them off was going to cause such backlash you know parents were riding you know uh, kids were crying and everything so you know I was upset you know and um, you know a lot of all these characters died you know Ironhide, Prowl, Ratchet, um, Starscream died which really sucks screw you Galvatron, um, Lenny you know what I'm talking about um, you know and they had all these new characters come in you know Galvatron, Cyclonus, uh, Springer, Hot Rod which took you know he uh, later become Rodimus Prime um, Ultramanus, RC, Springer, you know, Redguard had all these, you know, great characters, new characters that came in, which made season three was, you know, really, really good. Um, but, you know, it just, you, you had these other characters that, you know, you grew up with, you know, so it was uh, kind of traumatic, you know, they won't stand up for me or anyway. So, yeah, I mean, um, I, as a kid, I loved the movie, you know, and as time went on, you know, I, everybody had just grown to love this, you know. You know, everything, even the soundtrack with Stan Bush and all them doing that. Um, I listen to the soundtrack sometimes. It's on my Spotify. I listen to, uh, you know, certain songs will come on. And I'll just sit there and listen to it, you know. And just remember, you know, as a kid, you know, how, how much of a effect it had on me, you know, and everything. You know, it's that classic 86, you know, hair metal arena rock thing, you know, kind of going. So it was cool. Um, and I still listen to that kind of stuff. But, you know, that's just me because I'm old and everything. But, um... Yeah, uh, the movie is is great. You know, I, you can't I, you can't give more than you know ten Hell Hasbro's. I mean, there's nothing 
you know, that I, I could, you know, it can go 11, 12, whatever. I will always um, love this movie. You know, it will be one of my top five that I always, if I'm on dessert line, I will definitely take with me. Um, you know, and the great, you know, scene between Megatron and Optimus, you know, is iconic. You know, it's probably one of the best battle scenes that, in my mind, in my opinion, um, you know, and it's still great. You know, it's got Gravitron and Leonard Nimoy. You know, it's got all the, you know, great voice actors. Uh, Orson Welles does Unicron. Um, it was actually his last role before he passed away. Um, and, you know, just so many good characters, you know, that, you know, went on to season three and made season three really great, you know. And um, like I said, um, if you want to pick this up, um, I think Amazon has it. I don't know. A lot of people are trying to hard, kind of finding it hard to find because uh, Best Buy and all them other places are not... Um, carrying it or something like that but anyways definitely go pick this movie up if you're a transformer fan you have to have this movie i think that's just my opinion don't take it for you know anything else but uh definitely go uh, pick this up so yeah um you know 10 plus hell hasbros as always thank you very much for watching this um i hope you liked it if you do uh go down there and like and subscribe and share and all that stuff try to get me out there and um this is your boy deluxe and um hell hasbro as always and good night folks Good night, folks.